Hi everyone, David Chesworth here, fitness programmer and wellness coach with Hilton Head Health. Um, today I'm here to talk to you about uh, shoulder mobility, which is a part of our functional movement screen. And we have, um, for our test subject here, Felicia Hackett, our programs manager and registered dietitian. Um, so for shoulder mobility, again, just a refresher on the court scoring system. A three would be a perfect, two would be compensated, one would be incomplete, zero would be there was pain at some point. So in order for Felicia to get a three on her shoulder mobility, I'm first going to take a measurement of her hand length. So her hand length is six and a half inches. Um, so what I'm going to have her do next is put her palms out, thumbs inside her palm, make a fist, and then we're going to see how close her fists get together and back. So let's have you stand over here, starting with your right arm on top. Actually, I'll have you turn away from me. There you go. Right arm on top. Now, if she is within six and a half inches, then that would be considered perfect. If you're within a hand length distance between your fists, that's considered a perfect. And would you look at that? Felicia is a three <laughs> on this side. All right, go ahead and switch sides. On this side, she seems to be a little bit more tight, a little bit tighter. Um, she's actually eight inches away on this side, so just a little bit larger than a hand length away. So that would actually put her at a two. Um, the reason that would be a two is if you are within one and a half hand lengths, that would put you at a two. If you are above that, then you would be at a one. Um, and then to test for pain, Felicia, did you feel any pain? No. Okay, I'm also gonna take you through just a little check. I'm gonna have you put your left hand on your right shoulder. I want you to keep your palm down, lift your elbow up. Do you feel any pain when you do that? No. No? Same thing on the other side. Keep your elbow up. Any pain when you do that? No. That's called a shoulder impingement clearing test, and if she were to feel pain on that, that would make her a zero. Again, this is not a fitness test. We're not testing how strong you are or how cardiovascular fit you are. This is just a screening tool to say, okay, this is something that we would need to work on. So this would be a snapshot of her shoulder mobility. Thank you, Felicia. Thank, Thank you, everyone. Um, until next time.